Okay, there might be another issue which can happen. So I've, I've put it here on my Mac in front of me. So you open the Wacom Desktop Center, your tablet is connected, but the device is not shown in the Wacom Desktop Center. Respectively, it's saying no device connected. And you also see the spinning macOS beach ball and you cannot do anything, neither with the trackpad nor with the pen. And to fix this one, you have to again go to the uh, accessibility settings and to the security privacy settings because usually it's depending on those ones as well. Let's have a look. So first of all, I close the Wacom Desktop Center by Command Q, for example, or I simply click here and try to close it. If it's not closing down, it doesn't matter. So I just leave it as it is and I go to my system preferences here. And again, I go to security and privacy and I'm checking my usual suspects, which are accessibility and input monitoring. Let's check accessibility first. Here I can see, which is a rather new situation, the Wacom I.O. Manager is in there, but it's not active, meaning it, the checkbox is not ticked. To do this, let's go here on the lock, enter credentials again, and tick the checkbox to enable the Wacom I.O. Manager in here as well. Okay, that's done. Now go to input monitoring. Here we do the same. We see the Wacom tablet driver is in there. So far, so good. But again, the checkbox is not ticked. Tick the checkbox. Okay. And then click on the lock to store the stuff. And then again, we have to restart our tablet and then everything should run as expected. Thanks for watching.